I wasn't sure how to write a vow. I just wrote what came from the heart. <sighs> Hannah, I remember the first time I met you. I was working at Newtown and you walked in wearing a purple v-neck with jean shorts on. The moment I saw you, I thought you were the most beautiful woman I've ever seen. I still think that to this day. I have fallen in love with who you are as a person. You are funny, intelligent, strong, courageous, and independent. Throughout the years, not only have we grown together, but you have pushed me out of my comfort zone. I have personally grown because of you. Today, I am here because I cannot imagine my life without you. You look beautiful. When you are gone, I feel empty. I feel lonely. I know Ivy does too. <laughs> when I think about starting a family, I cannot imagine anyone else being the mother of my kids. I cannot imagine experiencing life without you by my side. You're everything I'm looking for. I promise to always try my best, to never let you down, to provide, to be understanding, to comfort, to listen, to protect, and always love you unconditionally. I love you more than anything in this world. Words cannot describe how excited I am to start the rest of our lives together. I love you. Max, I can't believe this day is finally here. So much has happened and changed since we first met at 19 and 20 years old. From vacations to Chichen Itza, snorkeling in Turks and Caicos, and ziplining in the Dominican Republic, to simpler but just as fond memories, such as watching Game of Thrones together, walking in the Arboretum, and feeling so utterly in love that going to Louisville for one weekend felt like an eternity. It's the simple things in our lives I tend to take for granted, but you continuously reminding me how special those moments are. The little things you've done throughout the years have not gone unnoticed. But I want you to know that I'll always love you, I'll always support you, and I'll always be here for you and our family. I cannot wait to see what the next six years and more holds. I love you. I love you too. You ready? Yeah, are you? Yeah, I'm ready. <laughs> Do you, Max, take Hannah to be your lawfully wedded wife? I do. Please take the ring from your dad. Do you, Hannah, take Max to be your lawfully wedded husband? I do. If you could please take the ring. Slip it on Max's finger.
By the power vested in me by the Universal Life Church in the state of Kentucky, I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may now kiss the bride. It's not